For some odd reason, I just looked at my videos and uh, the video that I had titled G Dragon Ball GT Better Than Dragon Ball Super. For some odd reason, it didn't upload, so here, here we go again. I feel like Dragon Ball GT is better than Super, even though Dragon Ball GT did rip off Dragon Ball. Wasn't wasn't canon. Was just a was just filler. That's all it was. It was a giant. Filler. But it was fun. It was fun to watch. Also, Dragon Ball GT had Goku start out weak and get stronger. That makes sense. What doesn't make sense? What doesn't make sense in Dragon Ball Super is. I'm sorry, Goku, would be Goku and Vegeta are both Super Saiyan God. And they can't take out they can't take out well Vegeta's understandable because he'd be weaker than Goku. Or would he be even would he be even would he be even to Goku in power because of they're both in Super Saiyan God. I don't know. I honestly don't know. Um. Dragon. Ball. Super. Has them start out as normal. But then it's like they skip Super Saiyan and ca they skip Super Saiyan altogether, and Goku can just go to Super Saiyan God whenever he wants to. Okay, I have a problem with this. First off, if Goku and Vegeta can go during Dr Super Saiyan God whenever they want to, what that what did that mean? The every battle in Dragon Ball Super would end in a couple of seconds. I mean, what's stronger than what? What? What's stronger than God? I mean, if you think about how Goku became a Super Saiyan God in the first place, it happened in. Dragon Ball Z Battle of, Battle of Gods, where Goku tried everything and he became a god, ironically, by fighting, by fighting, by battling the god of destruction. And that was the only way he was able to keep Beerus at bay. So, yes, I think Dragon Ball GT is better than Dragon Ball Super just for that reason. Has Goku start out weak, get out strong, get strong, and in Super, has Goku start out strong, but is, but can't finish off opponents, in several blows. That's all I got to say. This is Christopher Box. Peace.